using the Gutenberg block editor in WordPress. And so what I'm going to do, we've already uh, put in a WordPress blog. And all I'm doing is the final touches of this particular blog post. And using the Yoast uh, SEO editor, I'm adding the um, keyword phrase. So this particular blog post is about uh, water and whether it's hot or soft. And the, the actual slug is how to know if your water is hard or soft. So I'm using those words, water, hard or soft, right here. Because that's something somebody may Google or they may search for set. Is my water hard or soft? And this website or could potentially come up. And then I also added the meta description using the snippet editor. And what I wrote in here is learn how to determine if your water is hot or soft. In this article, I tighten the labs, professionals' choice for cleaning supplies since 1984. And again, we've got the same words, water hard or soft, water hard or soft, in the um, meta description. So we've got that saved. Now, the next thing I'm going to want to do is add a, a category for this. And I think the category is going to be, well, well, I'm going to talk to the client about it later, about which category to add. But we are going to add uh, some a featured image. And I have a featured image already up here, saved. It's right out of the blog post. And I'm going to go add that in, select it. So now we have a featured image for the blog post. The next thing I want to do is I want to add some internal links. Internal links bring people back to the website uh, when this is shared on social media. So I'm going to open up a tab here for their products. And Window Cleaning Solutions A1 Hard Water Stain Remover is something they use. So I'm actually going to link to that page. And here is first step is to remove the actual stains using A1 hard water stain remover. And we are linking that right there. Add a link. Uh, push the link, add the there, and then hit apply. And right now this site is still in development, so that's why you'll see Waterlink Web uh, there because it's on my server, and we will remove that later. Uh, so we have a link to our to water to hard water stain. The second step is avoid these stains to begin with. But we Confidently yeah, suggest Glass Gleam 4. So I'm going to go up here and go to Window Cleaning Solutions again. Glass Gleam 4 is a product. Click that and put that in right here. Linking it back to the website. You can hit the link. Apply. Okay. So, and then the newer companion product, the well-known Glass Gleam 3. So, of course, we're going to link that too. And back to Window Cleaning Solutions, Glass Gleam 3. Okay, go back here and go to Glass Gleam 3. Again, you always want some internal links, at least a couple, and we've got three on this one, so that's very good. Um, so we have internal links, which will help our SEO on this page, on this website, web post, and we have um, a, a featured image set in here, so that's very good. And you should know, whenever you're in a block, which is one paragraph of content, you can do all sorts of things within that block, but to get to the main body of the post, you click out of it, and then you are in here. So I'm going to add tags, A1, that's a tag. I'm going to add a tag for four. And I'm going to also add a tag for window cleaning solutions. Clean. And then I think the category 
will be, let's look at the categories we've got right now. Front page, janitor. I'm going to add a new category of category of window. And actually, since I am adding that as a category, I will take it out of the windows, the, out of the tags. It doesn't need to be in both places. So the primary category is going to actually be window cleaning solutions this time and not Titan Labs. So window cleaning solutions, that's what this is about. Oh, I should also add a tag of hard water there. So uh, I think this is pretty close to being published. I will show it to my client and um, let them look at it and we possibly make some more changes. But we do have a lot of a lot of the work done on this. And I am going to now save the draft. So that's how you uh, do a blog post, part two.